like the futuristic skyline of rural India. A vast natural wind tunnel, forests and farming having given way to a world leading green development. Here on the southern tip of India, locals used to complain about the wind, often strong enough to lift roof tiles off. But today that same wind, harnessed by 1,500 wind turbines, is bringing great wealth and a good many jobs to the region. Generous government subsidies and profitable returns have attracted big business. And that's brought new jobs. Hundreds are needed to keep these Indian-made turbines turning. <laughs> There are so many jobs here for me and others who have done technical studies. Otherwise, if this wind farm wasn't here, I would have had to leave the region. Instead, I can stay in our village happily. The money has seen a poor village prosper and bloom. A tidy town now home to many of the wind farm's workers. Previously, the wind was a curse and we had many problems. Now the wind brings with it money and everyone is happy. When we see the turbines, we are happy. Hey. But not everybody has seen the wealth. Maya Paruma's family sold their land to developers early on. I don't have a job here. I farm. Many did get work, but not me. There is no place for farming here now. According to experts, India could increase its onshore wind capacity by six times. It's an investment that would not only bring many more jobs, but would also confirm India's commitment to climate-friendly development. Tarek Basley, Al Jazeera, Aravai Mozi, Tamil Nadu, India.